Hey guys, how's it going? It's Bill Moore. Today I'm going to continue my reviews for Sarah and Dirk Marshall of Marshall's Oat Sauce. Not hot sauce, but oat sauce. Now this one is the Serrano Ginger Lemongrass. Now it says here that this is an aromatic blend of citrus and spice. Now please check out my first review that I did for Marshall's Oat Sauce where I reviewed their... Uh, Habanero Carrot Curry, just an outstanding product. If you love habaneros, carrots, and curry, then you're going to love that sauce. But uh, they're just really doing a fantastic job of these creating some very unique and all-natural flavor profiles uh, located out there in Portland, Oregon, and doing everything they can to use locally sourced ingredients. So let's go ahead and get into this one, the Serrano Ginger Lemongrass. It says, Marshall's Oat Sauce brings you limited edition small batch sauces using local ingredients whenever possible. Now, I did want to mention these are 4.1 uh, ounce size uh, bottles, uh, a part of a gift set that she sent me, uh, a, a gift set of four that I'm reviewing. But these do come in larger 8 ounce size bottles, which is very, very good because... Uh, these do not last long because they are so delicious. Now, I've only got that much left of this one, and uh, the reason is, is uh, I caught me young, my wife, uh, in the kitchen uh, one evening uh, when we had some uh, pork and kimchi uh, steamed buns, and she was going to town using this. She really loved it, and I had to, I had to tell her to ease up a little bit. I haven't reviewed that one yet, uh, but uh, let me go ahead and read the, the ingredients. Or Before I do, once again... Uh, notice the spelling on there for uh, oat sauce, not hot sauce, but oat. Um, you might have heard of oat couture. Uh, it's a French, a French term for uh, oat. It's a French term for uh, fashionable, high class, or elegant, uh, which you can see in their marketing, in their labeling, in their design. Really upscale type of uh, hot sauce or oat sauce, as they call it, which I think is awesome. Well, let me go ahead and read the ingredients. We start off with serrano peppers tomatillos, rice vinegar, sugar, lime juice, garlic, ginger root, lemongrass, and Jacobson sea salt, which is, I believe is a, a company there locally that they, uh, they get the sea salt from. So uh, I just love a green um, verde style sauce. And as you can see, that's exactly what this one looks like with the uh, serranos. Uh, usually you see uh, jalapenos paired with tomatillos. Uh, but this has got the fiery little green um, serrano peppers in there, and I think it's just brilliant with uh, with those ingredients. So with the uh, the ginger, the garlic, and the uh, ginger root and the lemongrass, just incredible. Now the aroma on this is simply amazing. Um, I love the way that Sarah builds her flavor profiles. Uh, she's very uh, meticulous, I believe, she has to be in, in using these ingredients and pairing these ingredients because I can smell every th single thing in here. Um, I get the rice vinegar. It comes up a little bit, um, so if you're not a vinegar fan, um, you may not uh, like that, but you can definitely smell the rice vinegar. But I've smelled the serranos, I smell the tomatillos, I can smell that awesome uh, ginger, garlic. smell the lime citrus just a little bit and then the more I kind of um, smell this and kind of study the aroma a little bit you can definitely pick up on that aromatic or that very fragrant um, kind of a floral like um, notes of lemongrass which is incredible kind of a kind of a grassy uh, minty um, fragrant aroma all right Enough of that. Let's go ahead and put it on the spoon. Look at that stuff. Isn't that beautiful? All right, here we go. Mm. Wow. Mm. Another winner. Absolutely fantastic. You get that immediate sting and bite from Serrano peppers because, you know, they're upwards of 100, 150 maybe not that much, but I don't know, yeah, around 100,000 um, Scoville units, so they can be pretty uh, pretty, pretty hot. Um, wow, just an amazing flavor. You get the sweet, you get that, that uh, lime, uh, you get the citrus, you get that savory garlic and the ginger, but you get that aromatic lemongrass 
a little bit there at the end, which is just fantastic. Really great job on this one, Sarah. Um, if you like a Verde style sauce, but you want something that is just a high class or a fashionable or elegant, uh, um, uh, you know, green sauce or Verde style sauce is what I'm trying to say, then this one's it with that ginger root and the lemongrass. Wow, it just really takes this one to a whole new level. But here's a picture of what I did with this one, guys. I had some kimchi pork uh, steamed buns uh, that I put this on, and it was just yeah, awesome, just really, really good. It's also fantastic on eggs in the morning. Uh, these sauces are great to use as finishing sauces, used in cooking, used to mix with other ingredients, I think is just really, really good. So for that, um, can't help it. Got to give it a 10 out of 10. This is another winner. Perfect perfection with those ingredients. Uh, just amazing. 10 out of 10, and on heat, uh, immediately I'm thinking two to three category. I think I'll give it a three out of 10 because you get a nice little nice little bit of heat from the serrano peppers. Uh, so about a three out of 10 for heat, but 10 out of 10 for flavor. Awesome job. All right, Sarah and Dirk, thank you so much for sending your products. I appreciate it. Everybody check this company out, please. Give them a like on Facebook. Check them out, see what they're doing. And uh, the website is Marshall's Oat Sauce, H-A-U-T-E. Dot com. Link will be down in the description, so check them out. All right, guys, thanks for watching. Stay tuned for more reviews, and until the next time, enjoy the burn. We'll see you guys later.